Cortez, what, what has this past couple months been like? The transition, getting to know everybody, and and kind of just changing the culture of the program. Uh, I would say definitely, it's been eye-opening. This is a lot different. As you go from you go from a different culture style, and all of a sudden things just boosted up, intensity, high level. And you're just going out, and it's just you don't know what you have that day. Like the first week we had attention training. Ooh, worst thing I've ever done in my life. But it definitely brought us together as a, as a group and a team. And uh, we loved it. By Coach Washington and, and getting to know him, and, and obviously he's got a great track record from Boston yeah, College. I mean. It, I talked to him for five minutes and felt like I'd known the guy for Definitely. ten years. So what's what's he what's playing for him? So like? much, so much knowledge in one man. It's just it, there's a lot of a lot of wisdom into him too. But the thing is, just like he teaches you, teaches you, teaches you, he harps it. And we just love him as a group. And we buying in and just doing what we got to do to play for him, basically. How do you take your game to the next level? What's the next step for you? Um, fast rush. That's one thing I'm focusing on. The next step and just. Uh, taking care of my body, because that's one big thing, eating right, nutrition. Obviously, I lost a lot of weight since my freshman year when I was 319. So I don't lost 50 pounds, so it's, it's, it's a big process. You don't have your your running mate with you now? Oh, yeah, Alex Face, I miss him. You're, you're the elder statesman now, though. Yes, I know. What's I know. that, trans him, what's that transition been like? Uh, the transition is just, you know, you got you got a group of people, and it's just like you got to lead them. So it's... And a lot of times, I mean, there might be some controversy, but you just got to go to them to the side because there's different type of leadership that you can bring on, on yourself. It's like everybody, you can't yell at everybody. You can't. Sometimes you got to go to somebody and talk to them one on one so they can grasp the concept of what you're trying to put into them and show them that you're trying to lead them to the right way and not just yell at them for, you know, for no purpose. So. This group, you came in, everybody was kind of young. I mean, you had a couple older guys, but a, a, a young group when you came in. Now you guys are starting all juniors, oh, redshirt yeah, definitely, sophomores, definitely. and does it feel like it's time for you guys as a group to break out? Oh, 100%, 100%, because it's just, and then with a new coaching staff coming in, it's just, you learn so much more, and going up as a group, you know everything about about your guys. We hang out all the time, we're together all the time. Just being being that close, close-knitted, so it's just, uh, it's, it's going to be a big surprise. What's uh, what's the, the weight room been like with Coach Collins? Woo. A little bit more, a little high definitely, intensity. Definitely. First day, who I was going through it. <laughs> this day it was definitely worth it. I'm, I'm glad. I'm glad we got Coach Collins. How about Coach Fick? What's it, what's it been like getting to know him? And oh, Coach Fick. Oh, he is just. He, he know he has tunnel vision. So basically, he knows what he wants, and he, he's going to get it done. No leniency. He holds the highest people accountable. People athletic or with the athletic ability accountable. It's just. He's a great coach, great coach. Everybody excited? I mean, is this a team-wide thing? You guys all look oh, at each other and definitely. say it's going to be a fun ride? 100%. All right. Can't wait. Good stuff. All right, man. Thanks. Appreciate it, Cortez.